Everybody loves. Today is just a video of me styling this hair from Labby Hair that I received and also doing a short initial review. Let's just get into this hair video. So please excuse how I'm looking. Anyway, my hair, what I did was I put it into a middle part and did like I used a new eco style and just gelled it. And then I left a little bit of my edges out and there's still some leftover gel from my last wig that I was wearing. But I'm going to be trying to slay this wig that I just made and the hair is from Lavi Hair. Anywho, so I'm going to do like an initial review after I wear it. Tell you guys the pros and cons and what I've noticed so far about it. So just stay tuned for that. And this first part I'm just going to try and slay it, make it look natural because... One thing I've noticed about myself with hair, I'm super lazy. Somehow it works for me sometimes, but sometimes my closures be looking a mess. Frontals don't be looking natural. And I figure if I'm going to be doing my hair, I got to slay it and put my time into it. So, yeah. Anyway, as y'all see, this, this cap is way too light. So, I'm going to take my foundation powder. This is NC50 from MAC. Just so it can match my hair, well, my scalp color a little better to look more natural. Anywho, so there we go. And let us try on the wig that I made. So let me move her all up in my space. <laughs> so usually when I make my wigs, this is what they look like on the inside. Um, I've already put some powder on the actual wig. But I usually make it with an elastic band and then I add wig combs. I have a whole video on how I do that. But it's just the most security. And on top of that, I use this Wee Grip headband. And it gives me, like, super security on my wigs. But I'm not going to use the headband. I'm just going to go right into it and just start testing it out. So, yeah. Okay, so my elastic band is a little loose. First thing. But we can always adjust that. This wig also came with baby hairs. And I cut them. But we might have to just completely cut them off because they don't look natural. So I'm going to use the new Eco Sala, the Flaxseed and Jamaican Black Castor Oil one just to do my edges. I haven't even tried this Eco Sala out like for washing goals or twists yet, twist outs yet. But I will soon. When it's like really hot outside, you know, summertime comes or whatever. And my edges look like they need some conditioner because they are not soft or not really trying to do what they're supposed to do right now. conditioner I love using this for any type of curly hair honestly I'm only gonna take a little bit like this much and just get them curls really defined I'm gonna work on the ends because they're a little actually the ends are okay on here and I'm gonna take my dimming brush and just detangle from the ends oh, I hope that you what can I say? Please recognize I'm trying, baby. Happy, wow, 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 wow. You see me happy, wow, 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 wow. You see me do me, da, 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 da. So me put it, wow, 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 wow. I overcut. I always overcut. I always get scissor happy. But it's okay. Right now this is what we're looking like. So I'm going to spray this curled up curl activating mousse just at the top to get the curls more well the closure flatter. The item dream in the cure But take it any time anywhere And not a spear So in the cure And as a woman I will be there Me I want a boy Take me away. Me, I want a boy who will wine with me. I want to go and make me feel it. Show me that you could boy. Baby, what can I say? Please recognize I'm trying, baby. Happy, whoa, 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 whoa. So, first thing I'm going to do is just.
first things first, just the details of this hair. This is from Lavi Hair. And Lavi Hair is an up and coming um, hair company. They're very affordable. So they're very versatile. They have so many different textures. And they're up and coming. Um, first things first, let me talk about their packaging, which was beautiful. I love their packaging. Yeah, their packaging comes in here, nice little baggie for you. What I like about this is that if you have like a wig, you can store it in here and it's silk so it won't get your hair all frizzy and stuff. And you know, just, it looks good and I'm a sucker for good packaging. I love good packaging. This is the Brazilian Italian Curly. Said, yeah, it's weird, Brazilian Italian, but I think that Italian Curly is just a type of texture. So there can be Peruvian Italian. Brazilian Italian I really don't know but that's what I just figured and the length I have in is first I have in a lace closure the lace closure is 16 inches and it came as a three part so it came like honestly sectioned off for you to either do a middle or a side but I ended up doing like a C shape so I was like let me put a C up in here and switch it up on them real quick you know and um, the bundle lengths are 18 a 20 and a 22 and some good news is I have a coupon code for you guys so just stay tuned I'm going to place it in the video and let me tell you I didn't even co-wash it all I did was add water a little bit of conditioner and some curling mousse and it is super soft so for shedding I did not notice any dramatic shedding but I did notice some shedding I did cut the wefts as I was putting um as I was sewing the wefts onto the wig that I made so sometimes that does cause shedding but nothing major and with curly hair you are normally going to experience more shedding than you would with any other texture and as for tangling i'm not really experiencing any tangling this hair is super soft super defined so i'm not experiencing any tangling yet even when i was sewing it onto the wig i still didn't experience any tangling so the smell it doesn't have that like super strong weave smell so i'm not exactly sure how much if you were to get this exact same thing in your head would cost I'll put it down below but when I was scrolling through their site I noticed that they are very affordable and like I said there's a wide variety if you can't afford the superior grade you can get the mid grade or the lower grade so it's just up to you so I'd say their pricing is pretty fair makes sense for you know the ranges they have the grades they have and the last thing or not the last thing but also just wanted to show you guys a link check the longest length in here is a 22 inch and I'm 5'4", and it is up to right here. So mid-back, stretched out, it does touch my booty. That after putting my foundation powder underneath the cap, I've noticed that I don't have to bleach these knots. Um, I think the part looks pretty realistic. Even in person, it still looks good. And like I said, I'm very lazy with hair, so I don't like to bleach knots. I don't like to do like mad plucking. I like to keep this as easy as possible, and with this hair, I was able to achieve a natural look without doing too much so I'm a fan of that and the wefts were very bulky like I said but I just noticed it and that's just a con to me and um, another con that I had which was kind of irritating was that um, normally I mean the lengths that I got were pretty long I guess they're average eh, the shorter the length the more hair per bundle you normally get but normally with me I have a small head I normally only use two and a half to three bundles and I'll have hair left over but with this hair I had no hair left over in my bundles and t towards the top of my unit like I was like oh my gosh I'm about to run out of hair so I had to like sew my tracks so far apart and I'm gonna show you guys cuz I videotaped it I mean in the end of the day I did achieve a full look and it all worked out but just for anybody who has a bigger head than me you're gonna need like four bundles to achieve like a full look so that's a con you know but I mean it all worked out and to rate this texture from Lavi here, which is the Brazilian Italian Curly, I honestly give it a 4 out of 5 just for this texture and my experience with this texture. 4 out of 5 because, I mean, look at this. It's popping. It's so soft. It's beautiful. And um, on the bad side, like I said, I was expecting it to be a little bit more hair on each weft. And um, also the wefts were kind of thick, kind of bulky. So yeah, overall though, I love the hair so much. I'm about to rock this hair. I'm even thinking of um, adding highlights into it, and I'll probably film a video if I end up doing that. But I feel like in the summer, it'd be really cute to add like some brown and blonde highlights. I have a coupon code for you guys to get $10 off your order with Lavi Hair. And the coupon code is Mariah D. And not like how it's spelled on YouTube, just Mariah and the letter D put together. 
So that'll get you ten dollars off your next order with Lavi Hair. And they have so much textures. They also have wigs, and um, you know I'm I love Lavi Hair. Like I said, you know how some brands are really up and coming and becoming more popular. I think Lavi Hair is gonna get up there very very soon. So get your hair while it's still cheap. You know. Anywho, um, thank you guys for watching and thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Go down below to look at all information. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in my next video. Oh, oh, oh.